Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 5th, which would be the full moon eclipse. Um, I, I hear there's some gossip going around. There's gossip, people talking. People that gossip are haters. They're jealous. So whether you hear gossip about me or about yourself or people are gossiping, keep in mind that those people are jealous. Okay? So whatever's going on, there's a lot of talk, right? People are talking, 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 talking. And I've had the, I've had, and the reason I say that is because I feel it. I feel it very strongly. Um, I've gotten a few comments that allude to that case. And um, I've, I've, this is like my third daily. And I did a daily yesterday as well. And we had the Three of Cups reversed a couple times. That is, that is bitchy women, jealous women, gossiping, um, haters. Uh, keep that in mind when you're listening to other people and what they're saying. Obviously... Uh, they don't agree with something or they don't like what they hear or they're jealous. So my advice is when somebody is gossiping about another person is to, to think about that person that is saying those things. Is that the kind of person that you can trust? Let's see what we got for around the fifth. They obviously have an ulterior motive or they have issues within themselves. So, what do we got for around the 5th? Now, keep in mind these readings are not time-specific, really, and they're not sign-specific, the daily vibes. Six of Swords reversed, not going anywhere. Ten of Wands reversed, making a conscious change. Somebody is, is letting go of something. They're, they're willing to let go. Okay, staying put, not going anywhere, nothing to prove, not trying to prove anything. Either of these cards, um, Five of Cups, the Tower reversed, and the Five of Pentacles. So, somebody is like burning, this is, this is Five of Wheels with Pentacles, they're burning um, money. interesting <clears throat> so this isn't going anywhere willing to do whatever it takes to bring balance let go of whatever it takes not gonna hold on I want balance I want peace I want harmony there's grieving but you notice there's one cup right here that is still available there's still an opportunity for love so there is this five of cups is usually there's two there's 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 a person that has been discontent they may have missed an opportunity or they lost an opportunity but obviously there's a big opportunity for love here so i think there's been some sort of situation where somebody um lost an opportunity and but there's still an opportunity. There is. There's, they may have lost it, but there's still a chance. There's definitely still a chance. This person doesn't look very happy. The tower reversed is, is all of a sudden. There, there could be a fight. There could have been a fight there's, that you never saw coming. This is major upheaval. This is um, universal change that you never saw coming. Extremely... Uh, chaotic perhaps this could also be a permanent loss um, this is a victim mentality but it, we do have two people that are sticking together they're sticking together okay even though there's been some sort of grievance there's been some sort of hardship not going anywhere which is interesting um, there may have been a fight or something but this is willing to let bygones be bygones that's what it feels like to me now, there's still a big opportunity for love and to build a new foundation. Perhaps a foundation crumbled, but there's an opportunity to build a new, stronger foundation together because these people are sticking together. They're not, they're not departing. I think that um, there's some lack of clarity here. Okay, there's lack of clarity. There's, there's, there may be some confusion uh, things uh, are not as it seems. 
it's been troublesome. There's been some sort of turbulence and, and maybe something to do with a child. Maybe there's a child that has caused some turbulence. I don't know. But this is grieving. Feeling, feeling some sort of sadness over a loss, but there's another opportunity. So let's see. This person, somebody is willing to do whatever it takes to change, okay? Because the Ten of Wands reverse is making a conscious change. There's been a loss. There has been a loss of some sort, and there's probably some regrets. This person has some regrets over the, you know, loss. This is the loss. It happened very fast, all of a sudden. Both of these mirroring each other could be a collapse. Something collapsed. But with the Five of Pentacles, yeah, it's been a hard time. It has. It's been a hard time. And we have poor health here. So we could have somebody here that whose health is not where it needs to be. This is consequences as well. Somebody is suffering some sort of consequences. Oh, but we do have a new beginning here, which I believe we do. So this is, a, we have an opportunity to start fresh. To, to build a new foundation. So we do have a new beginning. This is the beginning of a new journey. Uh, spur of the moment. Something happened to spur of the moment, which caused some upheaval and caused some great sadness. But we, it looks like we have somebody here that is reaching for a new opportunity. They're reaching for that love. They want it. They want it. So there is a new beginning in love here. There is. After there's been some sort of uproar. This is an uproar. And it was extreme. It was an extreme upheaval. Page of Pentacles reversed. Oh. Let me just focus this. The page of pentacles reversed is somebody that doesn't want responsibility, lacks common sense, doesn't really follow through, or doesn't have a lot to offer. You know, the page of want or pentacles reversed is uh, maybe insecure, may not have a lot of money. Um, Maybe financially insecure. This is definitely hard times. There's financial struggles here. This person uh, may not have a lot to offer. But sticking together to build a foundation. Going for it. Leaping. Taking a leap of faith. The emperor, so this, who, the emperor takes control, is very organized and structured, is a protector, a father, a husband, a business owner, has the skills to take the lead, very dominant, but this is, this could be giving up, there could, you know, I'm, something is going on here, this is taking a new journey having no fear and this guy's fearless as well so we have a fearless individual here who is about to take a leap of faith they are about to leap into a well this is a new chapter a new story they are they've been sad they've been grieving they've been focused on uh, something that uh, was lost you know they missed something but there's still an opportunity. This is big love. These, this is the Ace of Cups is big love. A flood of emotion. So somebody is uh, taking the lead, has made a decision that they are ready to fly. This is ready to fly. They're ready to start over. They're ready for their new life. They're ready for love. And this is a person that has been grieving. They have been grieving over a, a huge loss. And it may have something to do with a child, okay? Because we have a child here and we have a child here. So somebody may have not uh, followed through. 
they, they didn't do a good job or they, they didn't accept the responsibility maybe of being a father or something like that. Because um, this is not taking responsibility. And this is abandonment. Five of Pentacles is abandonment. So we may have some abandonment issues here. Somebody has been abandoned. May have something to do with a father. But this tower reversed is, and I'm not sure if we got some major health problems. We could have a father that has some health problems. It doesn't have to be. Um, but this is a, a trying to do too much and, you know. Let me get another card for that. Ten of Wands reversed. The Magician reversed. The Magician reversed. No resources. This person ha may have a personality disorder is it, or is very unbalanced. You know, something is going on here. It feels like we have an individual who isn't very healthy that may... May, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but this person may collapse or they may fall down or they may fall ill. They may fall ill because they're not taking very good care of themselves. They're trying to do too much. They're overworking themselves. This is, we have extremes. Now, this is a shock. And when, the, when cards come out in reverse, it's, it's an extreme, okay? It's an extreme. So, so this could be an extreme upheaval. This could be chaos. Somebody gets uh, a rude awakening. Okay, and this rude awakening comes from trying to do too much. They they do too much, and, and so you look at that trying to do too. You, when you do too much, it can cause um, it can cause inflammation. It can cause uh, internal uh, problems. Okay, because that's what I feel like it is. It could be an explosion of some sort. Um, It feels like there's abandonment of a of a somebody. Um, the magician reversed is, is is a loss of power. Somebody is losing their resources. They're losing their power. And another card. King of Swords. King of Swords. And the King of Swords is very direct. Very hard, very cold. Very opinionated. So we have a very opinionated individual that is losing their power. They're losing their resources. They may be losing their power to control a situation. And this is all about control. This The Emperor is very controlling. The King of Swords is very smart, very intellectual, very decisive. So we have an individual here that is, is very, very decisive. And he has thought about, he's thought about going someplace, but he hasn't done it. It's almost like he's been trying to prove his strength. He's been trying to prove... Uh, that everything is good, but it's not. There's a, there's a health issue here as well. I know I already said that, but I want to say it again. Somebody isn't healthy and they could collapse. They could, you know, have an internal disruption that sends them into, you know, you know something could burst. Okay, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but it could burst. Um, the King of Swords... This is a professional. This is a professional. But the magician reversed is... Well, this is a very masculine energy. The, the ma magician is very masculine. Likes to be in charge. But he's losing his power to be in charge, which could cause an upset. Now, the magician also takes action without thinking. So this person, we have this person thinks a lot. So we have an individual that has been thinking, and but I think it's like all of because this is a very sudden energy. All of a sudden, the thinking is over, and this person takes action, and they let go or they drop. They could drop. 
something this is the ten of wands reversed is dropping letting go letting go of the burden letting go of the baggage letting go of the responsibility magician reversed is um Knight of Swords reversed. My goodness gracious. Next to all these cards. We could be dealing with somebody that has a lot of air in their chart. A lot of insincerity. Somebody is very insincere. They're out of control. Explosive energy. Somebody could explode. There could be a verbal altercation or something could happen where somebody actually explodes. Or, you know, <laughs> Or something internally explodes. I'm just being honest with you. The Knight of Swords reverse doesn't think. Okay, this is this is out of control. This is a know-it-all. Somebody that looks for fights. Somebody that blames everybody for their mistakes. Doesn't want to be held accountable for their actions. Leads others into dangers. This is almost like a dangerous situation with the Knight of Swords reversed. This person knows what they want. They are very smart and intelligent. Um, deception deception somebody could be lying to themselves with the magician reversed this is an abuse of power and this one is too somebody has abused their power thinks that they are above the rest has been reluctant to take a new approach We have this right here. This right here is somebody that takes control. This very sudden energy here. Suddenly, something is going to happen all of a sudden. It feels like we have a masculine, okay? Masculine, masculine, masculine. This is a very masculine energy. So it feels like we have a masculine that is about to act impulsively, okay? Impulsive, 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 okay? So we have somebody that is about to make an impulsive move. It's going to cause some sort of major disruption. Probably it could be it could be, you know, there could be a child involved, you know, I don't know. There's going to be a major disruption here. Or eruption, abruption, however you say that. Um, this is chaos. This is a rude awakening. Um, it hits all of a sudden. Something is going to hit all of a sudden, which allows somebody to go down a new path. Okay, because this is starting a new journey. So we have an emperor that has decided or is deciding to let go. He's deciding to let go of something that has been troublesome. You know, he's thought about it, but he's thought about it long enough. Okay, and, and so all of a sudden he just boom does it. It's time to go. It's time to go. Um, I almost feel mental health issues here with these cards. You know, the Magician Reverse and the Knight of Swords Reverse. This part, we could have somebody that has some psychological issues. Okay, they really think that they're better than everybody else. This person thinks that they're better than everybody else, and they are reluctant to see things from any other person's point of view. Okay. It's a know-it-all. So we do have a know-it-all here that feels like this know-it-all is either going to be relieved of their responsibilities or they're going to choose to relieve themselves from the responsibilities. So this is being relieved from responsibilities. Somebody's being relieved from their responsibilities. There could be a fight um, that causes this. Okay. Uh, and this, but this, 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 this uh, instance that happens brings about a new beginning okay there's been a lot of sadness there's been a lot of grieving with the five of cups but this new beginning uh, brings in big love brings in new love okay it could be a very emotional time a very emotional time there could be grieving or there has been grieving there could be mourning of a loss this is the five of cups after all Okay, so there's, there's, you know, somebody, or they have been mourning over a loss. Now they see the light because the tower reverse is seeing the light. The light has been shed, so they see the light. There is definitely being relieved of responsibilities. Um, the emperor 
takes the lead. He takes the lead. He's very masculine. He uses his head. Uh, he shows no weakness and he's ready. He's ready. He's ready, uh, ready to fight. He has a plan. So I think that this, this emperor is ready. He is ready to let go. He's ready to let go of something. Eight of swords, removing an obstacle, ready to uh, step outside of his comfort zone. Okay, so somebody's ready to, look at that, right on the edge. Somebody is ready to step outside of their comfort zone. They've been in a space of mental turmoil for, which I can see over here. They've been in a state of mental turmoil for quite some time. And they may have even put in, been putting another person in mental turmoil. This could be another person that is, you know, trapped in fear, um, look, waiting for somebody to come to the rescue. This emperor is coming to the rescue. Maybe this person has been waiting, 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 thinking this, that, that the person that abandoned them is never going to show up. Put the page of... Um, the wheels gets me every time. The page of pentacles reverse. This is uh, somebody that drops out, doesn't show up, doesn't follow through. We have somebody here that has been waiting, waiting to be rescued. Probably really sad, very depressed, waiting, waiting. And, and somebody has mental health issues, whether it's the person that is waiting or the person that is coming. Uh, somebody may have abandoned somebody because of their mental health issues, you know. We all have them to a certain degree. I mean, people can say that they don't. That would be a know-it-all. I mean, nobody's perfect. But anyways, I feel like there's been abandonment because of uh, one reason or another. Obviously, there has. Um, but I feel as though an obstacle is finally being removed. This is a protector. This is somebody that is ready. They are ready to... Uh, Well, I think I'm at, this person is, is coming. I think they're coming. Six of Wands. Yes, they are. Yes, they are coming. They're done playing games. The battle is over. The answer is yes. They're ready. They're ready. Um, Six of Wands reverse. Which more can I... Or oh, it's upright. This person is done. They're done playing games. They're done with the competition. The war is over. The battle is over. Here they come. This is a leader. This is somebody who is strong and very dominant. They're all done. They're all, they're all done. They've won. They've won. They've won the battle. It's over. It's over. The battle is over. They're ready, in the next card is the Seven of Wands. They're ready to fight for something. They're ready to fight for a new beginning. They're ready to fight for, to build a new foundation, uh, to start over. So, uh, this public recognition here as well. Somebody may be publicly recognized for their valor, for their nobility. And this is a savior, okay? This is this is a hero. This is a hero coming to the rescue. So I don't like to uh, spout fairy tales, but this is somebody that it, that is coming. Somebody that is coming that has uh, fought a good fight, and the fight is over, okay? The fight is over. It's time to uh, start fresh with a clean slate. And this has to do with the heart because Ace of Cups is about heart. It's like somebody is reaching up. They're reaching up to the sky. They're reaching up to this new beginning. They're ready. They're ready to step into the, into the light. They're ready to step into the new life. So we do have a new beginning here. The fighting, the battling, the struggle is over. Okay? There's a new opportunity for love that is about to start. It's about to show up. It's about to show up. This is an opportunity to build a stronger foundation. We do have a masculine here. And I don't care if you like me or not. This is a masculine. We have a masculine here that didn't put in effort. That uh, may have felt inadequate or uh, doesn't have the resources to... Uh, prove themselves or, or something like that. This is lack of resources. 
but losing losing their power losing losing i feel like we have an individual here that at one time was very very powerful but now they're losing it they're losing their power and they abused their power in the past but when you know when you what i want to say is eventually you learn from that you learn from the trouble you learn from the trouble that you because this is very troublesome you learn from the experiences that hold you back per se anyhow we have an individual here that is taking action to fight for something that I think they left behind okay or there's gonna be a reunion or something like that I just feel like that we have a major new beginning here starting fresh starting with a clean slate breaking free leaving the baggage behind here and here the ten of wands reversed and the fool these are leaving everything behind it's, it's like throwing it off the plane it's like I'm not taking anything with me this is starting a new journey starting from scratch leaving the rest behind leaving it all behind and starting over so that's what we got here. We have a fresh new start that does lead to big love. This is a big, huge love. This is a hero. This is a, this is somebody that is coming in. They're 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 done. They're done playing games. Their battle is over. This is a protector. This is somebody that is strong. They are battle ready. They've already fought a good fight and they are they they know how to fight, okay? They know what to do. They're very experienced. So we have a very experienced individual that is uh, it's like almost going this person gave up they gave up or they abandoned a person and the person that they abandoned uh, has been waiting 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 and it doesn't and it's, somebody has been waiting okay I don't know who's coming in this could be somebody brand new or it could be somebody from the past Whoever is coming in is coming to the rescue in the nick of time. This is in the nick of time. This person is. This person has been waiting. They've been very sad. They've been very confused. Uh, they were. They didn't. Know, they don't know what happened. Uh, all of a sudden, they were abandoned, and uh, whoever abandoned them uh, gave up. But now they're done fighting with themselves or fighting whatever battle or learning whatever lessons they had to learn this is a protector coming in this is a protector this 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 is a, a brand new start that leads to victory with an individual who has a lot of experience this person has already been through chaos. They have been through upheaval. They have learned some life lessons. They have. Now they're ready for love. And here and here they come, I'm telling you what. So this is a fresh start. Somebody is, is about to spur of the moment. It's very spur of the moment. It's like all of a sudden, it's time. And it feels like it's explosive energy. It's like an explosion. Something explodes. One more card. There could be mourning. There could be mourning, grieving over a loss, but needing to realize that there's a new beginning here. There is a new beginning with that fool card. That's a major new beginning. I, I, so there is somebody is about to start a new phase that leads to victory and success. They are about to be uh, building a new foundation, a new home uh, with somebody that will not abandon them. And that is what I see. Good luck.